Evaluation can be defined as the systematic process of collecting and analyzing data to look at a program, objectives, or make a decision about a program. Your definition of evaluation depends on why you are doing the evaluation in the first place. Are you looking at the efficiency, the effectiveness, or the impact of the program? There are several benefits in conducting an evaluation. Some include having staff communicate about the program and learn from it, as well as increased knowledge of outcomes which will provide information for decision making. Some limitations include the fact that evaluation does not guarantee change, and the credibility of the evaluation is dependent on the credibility of the evaluator. Evaluation can happen at all stages of the program cycle to assist staff improving the program and making decisions. The evaluator's program description is the key to designing an effective evaluation. The evaluation model you choose depends upon why you are doing the evaluation. Throughout an evaluation, many types of data will be collected. It is best to include both quantitative and qualitative data in your evaluation. Many types of statistics can be used to analyze your data, including mean, median, mode, and range. Which statistic to use depends upon your level of data as well as your research or evaluation question. The biggest difference between research and evaluation is intent. In addition, evaluations often don't manipulate variables or look for causation. Whether you are conducting research or doing an evaluation, sampling is a big part of working with data. Different sampling techniques are used for different evaluation or research questions. As the final step to conducting an evaluation, no matter which method you use to write your report, clear communication of your evaluation is the most important thing. Created using Powtoon.